Yo, yo, it's Small Mouth Crush. Here we are back at it again, bright and early, early in the morning. We gotta get that epic topwater bite like peanut butter and jelly. They go together. A Rico and of peanut butter and jelly is like Rico and what? And Rico Suave. Rio Rico. No, we're gonna get this right. Okay, talk to me, man. Peanut butter talk. and jelly is like, is like a Rico, Rico and, and bass. Tidal and water? Yeah. Any water with Epic Eric. Hello. Here we are. So we're gonna go out, and this is Tackle Crush Tuesday. It is. And we're gonna Even throw a Rico. It's Thursday. We're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna throw a Rico around and share with you guys one of my favorite finesse topwater baits. Well, there's two sizes, so we're gonna throw a little we're twist gonna, as we gonna, always do on. Small that's all crush. coming up. Let's get out there. Let's do it. Could there be? Could there be incoming tide? With poppers. I'm coming back here to the wide open. We're gonna be up here. I don't think so. For the video. Of top water fishing in the slop, baby. Right? I don't know if we're going to I don't know if we're going to get a bite, bro. Get a bite out here. <laughs> I don't know. He just said, I don't know I if we're going to get a bite. <laughs> Whoa. Look at that stud. Dude, bro. that's awesome. Dang. Just so as he said, it. I don't know if we're going to get a bite. You know why Crack. I said that? Why? Dude, cuz I was just I wasn't feeling it this morning. Why? I don't know, cuz black, I'm using black. <laughs> Not the right color. Oh, that's funny. That's not the right color. All right. First fish. First fish of the day. On the Rico. That's not a bad bass. No, that's an excellent what bass. What do you think of that guy? I like it. Look at him. He's a beauty, See man. you, buddy. Look at cl crystal clear water. Okay, okay. What's he doing? I don't know. He's just kind of like... There he goes. Oh, gone. nice. Boom. Gone. So, crystal clear water, that's when the top water is going to excel. Would you agree? It's I would agree. nice to have Love some clear water out here. You want to get back at it. Stop holding the camera. Let's go. Let's do it. Oh, I missed them! Ah! <laughs> now, I would normally throw a, a Cinco or something. Yeah. But I ain't got one tied up. Oh, I do have that trick worm. I would throw the trick worm right back at him. I don't think we're going to have enough time. I know, he's gone. He might not be gone. Hold on. Damn, Randall. Hold on, bro. I'm trying as fast as I can. Do it. That was a good blow up. Right where he should be. Am I gonna have? Am I gonna get him? I don't know. I think he might be gone by now. Is that the spot? I think it was. Is he sitting in there waiting? He should be. That's another thing, guys. If you if you're throwing top water, you should have a bait to cast if right you away. miss one. He's hot. He's ready to go. And I think I took too long. You almost. You have to be cast. You you gotta be picking up that rod. As soon as you're... Oh, you had him, dude. Get him, man. Get you him, get him. Oh, yeah, good point. <laughs> That's right back to him. I was just like, what? All right, Eric missed it. I, that might have been the same fish. Let's see if he's going to bite me. Missed it. Would you think that was the same one? Oh, did you see that big beast? What the hell? Dude, that was a monster. Watch out, Brohim. Get him, get him, get him, get him, man. Did you see him? No, I didn't. You didn't see him. I did not see him. I watched fish. him come out and golf the bait. Five pounder, dude. Five pounder. Oh, there he is. Oh! Get that fish! Blow up. And one fish in the boat. That's pretty sad. I it mean, was sad. Normally you can get them hooked up pretty good. Yep. Seems like they were just, mm, I don't know, slashing more than freaking sucking. You know, it is a tide driven fishery that we're on. Yep. And we're kind of out of the good tide right now. We are. Uh, we just, we just kind of hit the, uh, I don't know, what was a better 
tide right away in the morning. Yeah, 6 a.m. But we've been out here for about an hour, five blow-ups. I mean, that's a bait you could probably get five good fish on if you commit to it. Yep. Oh, I, I believe that. Yep. A lot better when there's, I mean, there's a little bit of chop. We prefer a little bit. More you know, slick. You want to work that bait in the chop just a little bit more aggressive than you would when it's calm. Would you agree? I would agree. You got to give it a, you know, a pop. Throw some water. Especially. Now I prefer the hooks that they come with, nice round bends. I think they have really good hooks just out of the package. Do. You can switch it up a little bit. Some people throw EWG. Are you an EWG fan, Travis? I am, but not with the Rico. Yeah. But we're just kind of casting down some of these lanes here. And it's not working out as planned. <laughs> but we got to make some more videos. We do. So let's break down the baits real quick and move on with our lives. Let's do it. Let's do it. So I like to keep a variety of colors. Uh, you know, obviously your your whites, your uh, shad colored pattern baits are gonna work great. I got some perch in here. I do like that black one. I'm a fan of straight black. I got a big Rio in black as well. Bone white, little chartreuse. Maybe if I was doing a little smallmouth action. There you go. That's that's a sleeper for this color water too, man. A clear bait can be really sneaky. I mean, this is gin clear water, high sun. I do like a clear bait. That's right. right. Yep. They're expensive, aren't they? Oh my gosh, right? Twenty-five bucks a pop. That's that's crazy to think about. It Why? is. Why? But you're not going to lose a lot. What's this bait based on? You tell me, since you're the bait expert. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking maybe it's a shave down Zell Rollin. Is that what you're thinking? Designed to spit more than chug. Uh, Rico, Rico. There was also a uh, a Michael, which was a Japanese bait, still available on eBay. Same, similar body shape. It's a foil bait. I like it when, the, if you really are throwing a Rico a lot, it'll get down to the bone plastic. It seems like a chewed up Rico gets a few more bites than a perfectly foil Rico. I got gotcha. you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Do you have any that are just beat up? Well, I got this this black one no longer has a, a feather. Does that count? That counts. Okay, good. Well, not really, but... All right. Get out of this zone. Dang it. Unless you want to get get a fish real quick. I'm trying. You've been trying. I'm trying to. Dude, we had some good fish bite. We did. We did. I had both mine hooked up. I don't even know what to say. They felt the steel, but, you know, in a couple swirls, so just doesn't make any sense. All right, guys. Well, hey, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Leave any likes and comments below. Let me know what your favorite color Rico is, if you've used them in the past, what your thoughts are. And as always, until next time, we'll see you on the water with a big old Rico. Rico. Hey, we didn't show the big Rico. We should. We talked. We didn't show it. I showed them. Did you show them a big one? Oh, you did. The real Rico. You're good. We're out. Correction. See ya. See ya.